this is Michigan Constitutional Crusader out here in Finley, Ohio at the Finley Hancock County Public Library with C CRA audits. CRA audits. The guy who got attacked by the Finley PD. So Good old horse and buggy days right there. Dirt roads with poo piles everywhere. <laughs> People love seeing these old pictures of towns. Stroll around the book library. Recording started. That lady's sitting over there. All the way over there. She saw me coming and put her book up. <laughs> Sergeant, mm -hmm. right. yeah, I'm a little tired. Me. I'm just whatever we can see. No, okay. Just make sure you don't film people. Oh, okay. I can film people. Yes, yeah, so illegal. No, attention. it's not. If, if they're not. This is a public library? Okay, so. Person who works here. It doesn't them. matter. They are public employees. I don't think you're allowed to film them. Like the Supreme way. Court has ruled on this. We have the right to record our public officials in the course of their duties. They are public workers. We can record them. Absolutely, you might want to check into that. Yeah, we'll, we'll check in to yeah. make sure. Yeah. But you're just filming things, aren't you? Yeah, we're just walking through. Yeah. Whatever we see, we're going to record. We're not going to, like, stare at people and purposely record them. That's not what we're at about. All right, sounds good. Thank right. you. Yep. So, 
Right now, he's pretending to be a police officer. He just told me he's retired. Oh, really? He's wearing that badge. He's wearing, he's wearing a badge? Has that says he's a sergeant, and he just told me he's retired. Oh, wow. He's impersonating a police officer wow. with the Finley Police Department right now. Wow. Yeah. Just recording. Have you cleared that with? What, what are you recording? It, it, was, it was cleared when I was born. Well, that is unconstitutional on its face because the First Amendment of the United States Constitution, freedom of the press, overrules that, sir. Thank you. Right. And we're not purposely trying to record the employees. What did you say this time? He tried to bring me one of the um, like rules of the library. I didn't see that either, but he was trying to show it. Right, and, and that doesn't supersede the United States Constitution. And I should please stop talking to me because you're not even in the capacity of law enforcement. Right. He's impersonating a police officer. I'm not trying to go over there, that's where the children are. I'm going to keep my camera down. I'm not trying to get them. Wow, that's a heck of a drawing. Excuse me, do you guys have a copy of the U.S. Constitution for Dummies? Um, that would be a question for our reference desk. Oh, here. So through that next room and then to the left. All right, thank you. Yes, there's also a, a section up that way, too. you guys have a copy of the U.S. Constitution for Dummies? Are you not recording me? It's facing that way. Okay, are you recording for me? No, I'm recording the okay, plants right there. The, I do ask you to please stop. Please stop. I'm not going to stop. I'm not recording you, okay? You're obviously recording my voice. Okay. And you're recording me in that process. Okay. okay? So I am asking you to stop. I can put you to our policy, but they'll say that you're not allowed to. Policy does not trump law, sir. Okay. So are you going to look that up for me, please? If you are not able to comply, we're going to have to call the police because you failed to comply with the request to violate I, I don't work here. Policy is, policies apply to employees, not no, patrons. This is public policy, the library. I didn't sign up for it, so it doesn't apply. So arrogant. I, I heard what you said, sir. Could you simply look for the book and then I'm going to leave? Service right now, but 
where he's looking at the book for us. Okay. So we are allowed to ask for service. I don't like the way you spoke to me earlier. Do you have an official face badge? I do. You can't be retired. Uh, yeah, facing that way, dude. Is the audio on though? It doesn't matter. Okay. It does because Would you just look for the book, please? The section is 342.73. So you do have it? We do. In, oh, we thank have you. The Constitution and the Bill of Rights, yes. No, the Constitution for Dummies is the one I was I looking not. for. I do not see that on our collection. I'm kidding. Okay. Uh, actually, we do. Yes. Excellent. Because that breaks down the Constitution and the Bill of Rights so that the average Joe can understand it. I don't need it. I don't need it. I have a copy of my own. But maybe you should read it so that you understand it a little bit better. I'm not trying to be rude. But you need to have a better understanding of the Constitution and the Bill of Rights. Because what we're doing is 100% legal. And the policy... We are a limited public forum. But the policy we are does not... Public forum. We're not... It's you can't Right, so we can't cause a disturbance, we can't protest, we can't do things like that. But recording and staying silent and not pestering people is 100% within the law. I can't be certain that these don't apply. It doesn't matter. It does because of basic privacy. You're incorrect. You're incorrect. Like I said, I'm going to leave now. But I'm just trying to leave. Let you know that you're incorrect. And you're impersonating a police officer by putting that badge on. Yeah, security, not a cop. Comes up and speaks to us. That's what we're recording you because you can approach us. Okay. Was I ever rude, you guys? No, I never said no. you were rude. No. Never said you were. Never but said you were. I'm not impersonating the police officer. Well, no. technically. No, I'm a retired you, police sergeant. Right. right. By law, we as long as we qualify every year, oh. we can carry a badge and have a gun. So you have to. No, no, sir, basically. Yes. Right. Yes. We, we so kind of like you know, the same thing in Michigan where they have the M coals. You guys have to do the same kind of thing. I, I don't know what Michigan. That's does. their certification process. Yeah. So, well, if that's the case, the same thing in Ohio. As long as we qualify every year after we retire, after July first, anybody can carry a gun. Oh, okay. So. Well, I'm talking about the badge. It's, oh, yeah. Because that is yeah. an official badge. Sure. That's but it does right. say retired on it. Yeah, does it? Retired. Does it? Okay, yeah. I do. Yeah. Okay, I see it. Yeah. That's retirement badge. Okay. So, you know, I had 30 years. And yeah, I'm what sure. I so you guys understand that. Right. Yeah, but we're understand. not trying to cause trouble. I know that. You know, we're quietly walking through. Sure. We're just touring the building. You know, if we catch somebody on camera, oh, well, that's not what we're trying to do. But this rule here is unconstitutional on its face. Therefore, it does not need to be followed. Okay? Because anything we can see in a public area, we can record. The Supreme Court has ruled on that. It doesn't limited, matter whether it's a limited public forum or not. As long as we're not causing disturbance, trying to protest, or do anything that's disruptive. A camera cannot disrupt. It is an inanimate object. It doesn't scream at people. It doesn't make faces. You know what I'm saying? So, therefore, that limited public forum is... It doesn't apply. Doesn't our code of conduct usurp all of that as far as no. this building goes inside mm -hmm. here? United States Supreme Court and the Constitution and the Bill of Rights supersedes anything that's on there. Right. Not trying to be difficult. I know. I, I, you know, I got to be honest, I don't know. I just go by what Paul says. Right. You know, I got to follow what she says. So, so maybe for your own purpose, maybe you can look into that. And educate yourself on it. You know, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty darn sure I'm not. All right, man. You have a good day. All right. All right, all right guys. We're all here. Right, exactly. Have a good one, man. camera pointed over here we are catching my voice <laughs> i'm like so <laughs> oh my goodness. yeah he was being ridiculous
Well, we yeah, you got to get one of these. Yes, yes. Extra battery. Can I come in with my camera? Huh? Awesome. I love rocks. Are we gonna be on uh, video? <laughs> yeah, you'll be on YouTube. Do you want to plug your business? I wish I would have dressed differently. <laughs> <laughs> I literally like rolled out bedtime. <laughs> Been there, done that. <laughs> Do you have any polished Petoskey stones? No. No? Any unpolished ones? No. no. Bummer. Are you from Finley? Nope. I'm from Michigan. Okay. Out making videos? That's right. Do you want to plug the business? Sure. All right. Let's Go for it. <laughs> Just say the name of the business, the hours, and the location. Okay. We have funky hours, though. So it's kind of hard for me to say our hours. <laughs> oh, okay. Because we teach yoga here. Oh, okay. So we, have, we have really funky hours. Okay. All right. Hi, my name's Katie. This is the Lavender Hour. Um, we are open Monday through Saturday. We have our hours available on our website, which is at thelavenderhour.com. Thank you. <laughs> cool. Lots and lots of awesome stones, agates, and crystals. Smells so good in here. Thank you. Yeah. Can I get you a fried cookie while you're here? Oh no, thanks. Are you sure? I'm, I'm, I'm trying to lose weight rather than gain. <laughs> no offense. No. Is that big one for sale? This one here, my sister and I actually collected when we were in Sedona. Really? And I, I contemplate whether or not I will ever depart with her. I'm kind of attached <laughs> to her. Yeah. What is that? This is amethyst on blue lace like it. So, how much? Eight eighty eight. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's actually not a bad price for no, that big a piece. No, she's very big. She's very heavy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When people ask about the biggest stone we have, this one will definitely. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, this one is the petrified wood with silver quartz going all up the side. This one here? Mm hmm. That's cool. Yeah. That's yeah. awesome. Well, thank you very much. Thank for you. What's your name? Yeah, I'll give you my business card. It'll probably be a week or two before I get it put up. Did you just come to Finley to kind of like capture the Finley's energy? or? Well, part of the reason I came here is because the gentleman that's waiting for me outside was attacked by the Finley Police Department the other day oh, wow. for recording around the department and the municipal building. So that's why I showed up. Oh, okay. <laughs> so it's completely 100% legal. It's covered under the First Amendment, freedom of the press, for us to record our public officials in the course of their duties. So just like we were at the library, they tried to tell us we can't record there. And I explained to them that their policy does not trump the Constitution nor the Bill of Rights. So their policy is nil and void on its face because the Constitution rules. So they threatened to call the police. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Hey, what's the video that you're making that we're going to be in? Right now, I'm just doing a tour, walking around. Okay. Yeah. All right. Great, because ultimately we are yoga studio, so I just like to stay in like a peaceful vibration. Right. It's very important. Oh, we were very peaceful okay. over there. Yeah? Okay. Don't worry, I won't put you in the same video as the police. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> stay the love. <laughs> right, right, I hear you. You have a wonderful day. You too, thanks. Yeah. All right, we'll see you.